This video will provide an overview of the Pathway Tools software environment. Pathway Tools is one of the broadest bioinformatics software systems. It's been licensed by more than 10,000 groups and it's free to academics. It lets a user create and maintain organism databases that integrate multiple types of information. It's, it's a data management environment for individual genomes, collections of genomes, or for metagenome assembled genomes. And by data management environment, I mean it enables the user to search for data, to visualize results, and also to edit these databases, updating gene functions or pathway information or updating the sequence. Pathway Tools contains genome informatics functionality, pathway informatics functions, regulatory informatics. It also has a number of omics data analysis tools, and it has several comparative analysis tools. Here's an overview of the, the main components of Pathway Tools and how they work together. One first imports an annotated genome into the Pathway Tools environment in the form of a GenBank file or GFF file, and the pathologic component of Pathway Tools creates a new Pathway Genome database that combines the annotated genome with inferred information such as a metabolic reconstruction for the organism. The Pathway Genome Editors can be used to interactively update that database, such as by adding a new metabolic pathway, or adding a new metabolite, or changing a gene function. The Pathway Genome Navigator enables the user to search and navigate this Pathway Genome information space, as well as to perform omics data analyses. And the Metaflux component lets one build a quantitative metabolic flux model using flux balance analysis from a Pathway Genome database. The pathologic module of Pathway Tools is its inference module. It imports a, a genome into Pathway Tools and then adds various inferred information to the genome. For example, it predicts the metabolic network of the, of the organism performing a qualitative metabolic reconstruction it predicts the reactome, the metabolites, and the metabolic pathways, all of which are imported from our MetaPsych database. It will also calculate pathway abundances for metagenome data. It will predict the genes coding for missing enzymes in metabolic pathways, which we call pathway holes. It will also infer transport reactions from the names of transporters in the annotated genome. And it has an operon predictor. Now, pathologic can be run interactively, but it can also be run in a batch mode for processing hundreds or thousands of genomes. Part of the reason why the Pathway Tools metabolic reconstructions are so powerful is because they're derived from the MetaPsych curated metabolic pathway database. And as you can see, it has many more pathways than the KEG database does. Also, almost 50% more reactions than KEG does. It does have fewer metabolites than KEG, but very importantly, it has many, many literature citations and many mini review summaries that summarize information about genes, proteins, and pathways uh, that are largely absent in KEG. The genome informatics capabilities of Pathway Tools include the abilities to search for genes and proteins and RNAs, as well as to search for genome sites and these searches can let the user search by many different criteria. There's also a gene information page where the user can retrieve the nucleotide sequence of a gene or genomic reg region or the amino acid sequence of the product. There's a transcription unit page that shows regulatory sites and regulatory interactions. There's a BLAST search, a sequence pattern search, and a sequence alignment capability. The software can map SNPs to genes and show the effects on translation. And there's a genome browser that lets the user zoom from the full chromosome to the sequence. There, it also has a comparative mode and a tracks facility. And one can paint omics data onto the genome as well as to generate a genome poster. The pathway informatics tools include pathway search and a pathway information page. Pathway diagrams can be customized in various ways for publication, like removing EC numbers or adding substrate structures. One can create personal multi-pathway diagrams where 
multiple pathways are combined together in one screen, and there are comparative pathway analysis tools. There's also reaction search capability and a reaction information page that shows reaction atom mappings. There is a metabolite search and metabolite information page, again with multiple different search criteria. And the metabolite page shows all the reactions and pathways that a metabolite is involved in, as well as the regulatory effects of a metabolite. There's a zoomable organism-specific metabolic map diagram, and we can generate a, a metabolic map poster from that diagram. There's also a metabolic root search tool that computes optimal paths connecting a starting metabolite to an ending metabolite. And there's an ability to construct quantitative metabolic flux models. The regulatory informatics capabilities of pathway tools include capturing both regulatory sites and multiple types of regulatory interactions. And there are regulatory queries such as finding all the enzymes whose gene is negatively regulated by FNR, and the results of that query are highlighted here on the metabolic network diagram for E. coli. There's also a regulatory network browser. There are a number of metagenomics data analysis capabilities, including performing pathway prediction for metagenomics data, including calculating pathway abundance scores, the user can also create pathway genome databases for metagenome assembled genomes or for the entire microbial community. There's also a multi-organism version of our metabolic root search tool that computes an optimal route from a starting to an ending metabolite via multiple organism metabolic networks. The software can also create metabolic models for individual members of a microbial community and combine those models to simulate the full microbial community and we can create multi-organism metabolic map diagrams. The transcriptomics and metabolomics data analysis tools include a tool called the omics dashboard, shown here at the right. The ability to visualize omics data onto individual pathways and these personalized multi-pathway diagrams, as well as on the zoomable metabolic map. We have enrichment analysis of both transcriptomics and metabolomics data as well as genome visualization of transcriptomics data and regulatory network visualization of transcriptomics data and the ability to compute pathway covering sets for metabolomics data. When we generate metabolic models in pathway tools, we first perform a qualitative metabolic reconstruction with Pathologic. The Metaflux component then converts the pathway genome database to a quantitative metabolic model through components that infer the biomass components of the organism and that gap fill the reaction network using a very accurate taxonomic gap filling method. The software can determine whether all biomass components in the model can be generated from the starting nutrients or name those specific nutrients that are not generated. And it can visualize the, the results of running the metabolic model, the computed fluxes, on the metabolic network diagram. 